Today I'm going to show you how you can protect your windows from viruses in just three simple steps. Hi, welcome to TechV channel. On this channel, we're going to be talking about computer tips and tricks. And if you like these sub sub videos, don't forget to subscribe. Okay, you have to use antiviruses, but one of them is not really useful. You have to use at least 20 of them at the same time. But how? I'm going to show you. Okay, go to virustotal.com. This is a website that you can use multiple antiviruses at the same time for one file. For instance, you can upload your file from your computer or you can insert your URL. For instance, I can use this URL, coupling address. This is a test virus and I can paste it here and press enter. Here you can see malicious malware, malicious malware. They are antiviruses which are working on my file. And as you can see, for instance, if you have just ever on your system, you cannot find this file as a virus. So you have to use antiviruses at the same time. You have a file, you want to open it and you don't know this is really harmful for your computer or not. Okay. On Windows, we have a sandbox. We have a place that you can open those files. You don't know this is really harmful or not and find out this is a virus or not. For instance, I have this file and I don't know this file is a virus or not and I want to open it to install something. So I have to use sandbox, but before that I have to turn sandbox on on my windows. I have to go here and search windows features. And you can see turn windows features on or off. You have to click on this and here you have to find Windows Sandbox and tick Windows Sandbox option as you can see and click on OK and restart your computer. After restarting you have to see Windows Sandbox here. You just need to search it Windows Sandbox and open it and as you can see, this is a virtual machine and this is completely isolated from my main windows. So if I run something inside of sandbox that cannot harm my main windows. So all I have to do is going to here and copy this file. And here I have to paste it and I can open it. That said, okay, this is not a virus. And also if something broke your sandbox or your sandbox files, this is not really important for your windows, your main windows. Okay, as our last step, inside of windows, we have a software that we can use to delete viruses or those files which are harmful for a computer. Okay, all you have to do is going to here, and search run and you have to open run and inside of run you have to type MRT and click on OK and as you can see Microsoft Windows malicious software removal tool you can use this software to delete viruses malicious softwares and all bad things you have installed on your windows and here you have to click on next and you have quick scan, full scan, customize scan, anything you want and click on next and delete those softwares. If this video was useful, don't forget to like. And if you have any problem with this process, don't hesitate to comment below.